what is wrong with ibuprofen? So ibuprofen is an NSAID. It's a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory. What NSAIDs do is they cut off the inflammatory cascade. And when you get injured, it takes about 300 days, give or take, for full collagen production and stability to set in. It's a whole cascade. And the first two weeks of that 10 days to 14 days of that healing cascade uh, need to go to fruition for the rest of that cascade to happen for you to end up ultimately laying down really healthy, strong, stable collagen. And if you cut it off in the first few days with ice and NSAIDs, mm. which that's what is usually doctor recommended, right? Elevate ice NSAIDs. Yep. You basically shoot yourself in the foot. And so they've known since the 90s that when you give somebody, like they were doing studies in rabbits where they would pith the cartilage in their knees and then they would give them high doses of ibuprofen and the cartilage just would not regenerate. Orthopedic surgeons know not to give ibuprofen because it actually inhibits bone healing after a fracture. And then there's a whole litany of problems that it causes within the body, the cardiovascular system and you know the gut and so on. And then when you're on high doses of NSAIDs for a long period of time, if you discontinue them abruptly, you can have a rebound effect where you end up in more inflammation. And so it's a really slippery slope that I think, especially like college or even high school students, uh, athletes yeah. get we did that a lot in college. Yeah, there's a lot of NSAIDs and ice, and it's just a really bad way to train your immune system to react to an injury.